Today I'm playing Endless Memories by Homunculus Games. I like the animation in the background here, and the text is really nice. Let's check out... Oh, I like this little animation too. Let's check out the options. Vertical sync, music, effects 100. What does that mean? Okay, screen check. Okay, fair enough. Let's start. Uh, new game. My voice is kind of shot, so I apologize. Ooh. I like the graphics, and the animation is really nice, too. Are you going to teach me how to jump? Oh, that's a column. Okay. Open menu. I have an ascended sword. The music is good, too. A map. Very Metroid. Z to jump. And I have a wall hang. That's good. Down in Z, you drop. Looks like there's no fall damage. I always like it when games establish if there's fall damage or not. There's a firewall. Okay, C to dash. Ooh, that didn't work. D to use potion. Cool. There we go. Z and C to jump dash. Uh, shoot. Okay, so it's not like an air dash. It's like a... There we go. Oh, no. That didn't work either. Okay, I have a double jump. Didn't really specify that in the tutorial. But I figured it out. Ooh, here's a bandy. Okay, there's my sword. How about you? Ooh, I like the uh, effects. The little subtle screen shake and the effects are really good. Up to counter. Okay. I can't see him. I pressed up. What's the timing? Maybe up and attack? I'm gonna get this. Up. Oh. No. Up and attack. Uh. Yeah. Well, forget it. V to pick up. My cat is putting her tail on my keyboard, which is making it hard to play. A bow. Press A to use the bow. Cool. But it uses magic. Okay. Or whatever that blue bar is. Up to interact. Wrong button. Need to pick up. Cast a magma meteor that deals area damage. S for magic. Okay. So the game feels pretty good. Um, like my momentum and stuff. Oh, I didn't know I could smash these. Is there some kind of currency in some kind of shop, I wonder? That looks like currency. Anyway. Oh, okay, S to magic. S to magic. There we go. Oh, I'm gonna die. And A to bow. Okay, these are magic crystals. I gotcha. Uh, jump. Too many buttons. I wish I had a shield. Maybe I can dash through those. <clears throat> Flying person. Dash, 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 dash. I'm doing it. <laughs> the 
This is fun. Ooh, it's a big boy. This is beyond your understanding. You are not ready. That seems a little unfair. Laboratory of Dreams. Do I move? Do I jump? Do I attack? Oh, I attack. Just did a bunch of property damage. Where am I? In a hallway. Here's another person. doing it. Is this helping? Maybe? I don't think this is helping. that the doors tell you if they're locked or not though. Uh, where do I go? Map. Maybe to the left. I'm not, I don't fully understand what these little ticks on the map mean. They seem to indicate doors, but I'm not seeing them. That's where I came from. Well, it's got to be back to tank person. Oh, maybe you hold it. Oh, that's the thing. Am I dead? Devisland. Devisland? Devisland? What is this? Are you friend or foe? I'm going to assume foe. Oh, I can talk to you. <laughs> Did you just come out of that thing? Amazing. Well, good conversation. Hello? Can't talk right now, mister. I'm trying to find a way to start this windmill again. The rain made it really rusty. Tried everything, but the problem seems to be outside, and this rain won't stop. When it rains around here, it takes months to stop. Thankfully, it helps our vegetation, but with a windmill like this, there's no way we can produce enough energy for the town. Hmm. I see. You said something about it being outside. Can I fix? Can I smash? I can't seem to attack in this town. Probably for good reason. Are you a shop? A shop? <clears throat> You're a shop. I need 750 green. How much green do I have? It's weird that the text kind of doesn't line up with the UI. In. No. Can I buy this? No. What's the buy button? Talk to me, creature. Welcome to my shop. I'm the shopkeeper. Well, that's how they call me around here. That's how they call me. But my real name is Kubo. Please call me shopkeeper. I don't like calling me by my real name. I actually never liked my name, but shopkeeper gives me some status. You see, Rim sounds like a good name. It kind of fits you. Well, welcome to my shop, Rim. Feel free to look around and get whatever you need. If you have the green money. Alright. My voice is starting to hurt, so I'm skipping some of the conversations. What is this? Lightning ball. 
Reveal your secrets. No secrets. Okay. Hello? Sorry, sir, but I cannot open this gate without permission of the Lord. I assume the big opulent house is the Lord's house. This one. Are you the Lord? Go speak with the Lord. He is expecting you. Oh, this is a door. Turn on some lights, dude. I'm... <clears throat> I've been waiting for you, Rim. So many nights have passed. The time has finally come once again. What you are looking for is through... I think that's a typo. There's an H in the word through. Uh, the Forbidden Caves. The link is located in the hidden jungle inside the caves. The link to what? The prophecy must be completed, Rim. But Captain Kroig still has control over the woods. He possesses the power of thunder. Go retrieve it and continue your journey. Possess the power of thunder. Take this letter. You'll also need a weapon. I have a sword. Go see Kubo. Okay. I met Kubo. But he doesn't like being called Kubo. He likes being called shopkeeper. What's up, shopkeeper? The Lord sent you. You must be something special. Not everyone gets f a stuff for free from my shop. I don't know if that's a typo or if he's just uh, charmingly illiterate. <laughs> Here, take this sword. It's not much better than nothing. Come back with some gold. That's gold? Okay, and get yourself a proper weapon. Green gold. Hey, don't worry. If you don't carry gold, you can come back anytime. Uh, how do I pick you up? Uh, oh, I learned this in the tutorial. It was the V button. I'm a smart. Oh, I'm sorry. I broke your house. I didn't mean to. I'll pay for it later. Maybe I can get the lightning ball now. Reveal yourself, lightning ball. Nope. Lightning ball wants to keep its secrets. All right, bro. Yep, I got the letter. Whatever my intentions. Kroig. Okay, these are definitely foes. I know a slimy foe when I see one. I gotta say, the background art in particular is really pretty. What is that little yellow bar above my health, I wonder? I got something. A knife. Is it better than my wooden sword? Oh, I see. You don't actually have an inventory. You just swap them. It looks like... The knife is better. Well, yeah. Looks like the knife is better. If we do the maths. I'm about to die. How do you drink a potion again? Uh, M? No. What was the... Hmm, B? N? F? G? I can't remember. Is it D? It's D. I need to do it again. Okay, full belly. Ooh, what is this? Extra damage with scythes. Sure, but I don't have a scythe. Uh, magic attack. Which one is that? Oh, I don't have my, my weapons. That first thing was a dream sequence. 
Is there any advantage from fighting guys other than just getting experience? Ow. I mean, loot, not experience. Oh, there's gold, too. Yeah, I don't know if, like, leveling up is a thing. Well, that answers that question. I'm going to die if I don't get <clears throat> some sort of healing. Hanging meat? Nope. Hanging meat does not heal me. There's a house here. Maybe there's a friend. What is this? What is this? Oh. That's exactly what I needed. Aha. Uh, switch. Switch. I don't know which way is the good way. Can't climb that. I can wall grab other things. I can't wall grab that though. Nope, darn. All right, well. Down we go. Hmm. I see. Oh, that's what that thing was. You smash it. All right. Hopefully that did something up above. Oh, I guess that yellow bar was a, an experience bar. That would make sense, right? Oh, I see. You use this to get up there. An iron scythe. Yeah, that's a better weapon. Plus, I have that scythe ability I picked up earlier. Can I smash you now? No. One thing that would be nice, um, from using a knife to a scythe, I'm realizing that range plays an important role. But there is no range stat when you pick up items. That might be a nice thing to know before you swap your weapon. Well, that's a big boy. Is there a point in fighting you? Ow. No. Oh, I did it. My old Mega Man X skills are coming back. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna die. D. That's the one. D again. Magic. <clears throat> I'll take magic. Broken sword. Hmm. Dark Souls is calling. They want their broken sword back. Ow. I did it again. Uh, okay. That was kind of hard to tell that that was a door. It sort of blends in with everything else. Uh, can I lightning you? Ooh, I can. Oh, there we go. 
That's pretty useful. What is this? A profane claymore. Uh, sure. Let's try it out. Seems like all weapons swing the same speed. So that's nice. Look at this little frog. Are these, like, checkpoints? Right. Oh, well. So much for that. Yeah. Haha, -ha, that was cool. I liked that. Ooh, these things are gross. And pretty tough. I'm probably gonna die. Uh, magic. Magic. Yeah. Do it again. Okay, frogman. Whoa, what was that? Can I charge up? You can. That's cool. Oh, man. I got killed by a frog. Oh, man. This is pretty far back. Well, I think I'm going to call it here. This is really fun, though. Um, the controls feel really good. The combat feels good. The enemies are interesting. And I like the loot system and everything. I think this is a pretty nice game. And I could see myself playing this. So I'll definitely keep an eye on this one. Nice job.